Hello everyone, this is Dr. Sam and this video is about hydronephrosis grading on ultrasound. Hydronephrosis is the swelling of the kidneys due to accumulation of urine. It can lead to dilation of the renal pelvis and calluses. The degree of dilation of the renal pelvis and calluses determines the grade of hydronephrosis. In the normal image, this outer hypoechoic area is the renal cortex. This hyperechoic bright area is the renal sinus. It appears hyperechoic due to fat. This small area between the renal sinus and the cortex is the medulla. This is an image of a normal left kidney in longitudinal plane. The image on the right is grade 1 hydronephrosis. It is a mild form of hydronephrosis in which the renal pelvis is dilated, but the calluses will mainly be normal. This anechoic area is the dilated renal pelvis. Since mainly this area is dilated due to accumulation of urine, it is graded as grade 1 hydronephrosis, that is mild hydronephrosis. No parenchymal atrophy means there is no cortical thinning. Cortical thinning is usually seen in very severe hydronephrosis. In normal kidneys, the renal pelvis may not really be seen clearly and also the calluses are not really visible. Grade 2 hydronephrosis is also a mild form of hydronephrosis in which along with a dilated renal pelvis, there will be some dilated calluses as well. These are the calluses of the kidney and they are enlarged and filled with urine. They are all anechoic. So in this kidney, there is enlargement of renal pelvis and some calluses. Not all calluses are dilated. The calyx in this region looks normal. This is a normal image of the right kidney. This hypoechoic area is the cortex and the inner hyperechoic area is the renal sinus. You can see that the renal pelvis and the renal calluses are not clearly seen. This is another image of a grade 2 hydronephrosis in the right kidney. The renal pelvis is dilated and the major calluses are dilated, but the minor calluses are not dilated. So not all calluses are dilated. So this is another grade 2 hydronephrosis. The cortex has a normal thickness. This is another case of a grade 2 mild hydronephrosis. The renal pelvis is dilated. Some calluses are dilated. But this region looks normal. So this is a grade 2 hydronephrosis. In this image of grade 2 hydronephrosis, the calluses in the lower pole of the kidney are dilated, but the calluses in the upper pole appear normal. So some calluses are dilated and the renal pelvis is dilated. So this is a grade 2 hydronephrosis. The renal cortex is normal in thickness. This is another image of grade 2 hydronephrosis. The renal pelvis is dilated and the calluses are dilated in this region, but not all calluses are dilated. So we will grade this as a grade 2 hydronephrosis. A grade 3 hydronephrosis is called moderate hydronephrosis. The renal pelvis is dilated and all the calluses are dilated. 
there is uniform dilation of all the calluses in the upper, middle and lower poles. The dilation is also much more than in previous images. There will be no parenchymal atrophy, no cortical thinning in a grade 3 hydronephrosis. The cortical thickness is normal. This is another image of a grade 3 hydronephrosis. The calluses in upper, middle and lower poles are all dilated. The renal pelvis is also dilated. This is another image of a grade 3 hydronephrosis with a cyst. This is the cyst and these are the dilated calluses in all upper, middle and lower poles of the kidney. The cortical thickness appears normal. In grade 4 hydronephrosis, there is severe dilation of the renal pelvis and the calluses. All the calluses are dilated. Also, there is thinning of the cortex. You can see a grossly decreased thickness of the cortex as compared to the normal image. So this is a grade 4 severe hydronephrosis. This is another image of a grade 4 hydronephrosis. There is severe dilation of the renal pelvis and all the calluses. The cortex is very thin. It has a decreased thickness. Cortical thinning is seen in a very severe grade 4 hydronephrosis. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe and stay tuned for more imaging videos.